What is up guys, Master Gaming here coming at you with episode 3 of Spooky House. Uh, I'm going to be doing a little bit of commentary and and talking about something else all at the same time. So stick with me through this. Uh, where we last left off, uh, we was cleaning the house up, you know, but right now we're going to go take on some ghosts that escaped the paintings that uh, Boo had released from the, uh, <clears throat> from the paintings from the first time to help out Professor E. Gat. So now we're on our way to go do that. So with that, let's get started with that. Um, another thing I wanted to talk to you guys about today is I've been hearing a lot of uh, uh, things about uh, how people should grow their YouTube channels. And um, I've been wanting to get my own personal input how I think somebody should grow their YouTube channel. This is my own personal opinion. And if you don't like it, well then, hey, you don't like it. But if you can understand it, then that's good too. But um, the way I feel how, you know, you should grow your own YouTube channel and, you know, make it big is that, you know, try to, well, network, you know, don't always pester, like I say, don't always pester everybody by saying, hey, come like my video or such, or hey, can you check this out, or hey, if I sub to you, then you can sub to me and then uh, I can get more subscribers that way. Um, the way how I do mine, that you guys have noticed, is on my Viva Twitter. I would just tweet a couple of people that I know that really helps me out with my channel and be willing enough, you know, to give me support and get myself out there. I don't tweet just random people. Uh, I'm not like that. I don't just randomly just pick your name and tweet you and say, hey, check out my video whatsoever. It's with me. Um, I will have to, you know, have a little conversation with you. Like before, like me and you have exchanged tweets before I have checked out your videos in the past and then you checked out some of mine and then with from you liked my videos you subscribe to me and then i subscribe to you because i liked your footage but the way how it is it is if you subscribe to me and and i have subscribed to you and liked your content then i will let you know whether i will let you know the videos that i upload or that i like to help get support i don't just randomly just pick people out of my uh, followers list and just tweet them and tweet them and tweet them tweet this no it's somebody that actually you know talk to another commentator about seeing their work like they work and they like my work and they would love to see more from my work so that's how i do it now if they choose to retweet it and it comes up on somebody else's timeline that's fine too because they chose to retweet it because they thought that my work was so good that they should share it with everybody else i have no problem with that i feel that we should as a gaming community of commentators should do that more often by us, you know, retweeting our video uploads, trying to get each other's more known out there. But um, this also goes for the bigger channels. You know, the channels that don't hardly ever look out for us. Um, you guys need to stop being like that. And just that's my personal opinion. You guys may hate me saying they don't have to do it or whatsoever. Or I had to work my way hard up here without nobody helping me. Well, everybody needs help. And in this community, we all need help from each other. Nobody can't become a big channel overnight. It takes time and patience. And I understand that you work yourself up from the bottom without anyone helping you out or whatsoever. But how about you go help that one unfortunate YouTuber that's been working his butt off two months. And he still only has about 10 subscribers. But he has posted over 50 videos. You know, come back and help out the small channels. Like, I love what um, Overflow is done doing. Even though his channel may not be big like other big YouTube channels, it's still quite popular. And he doesn't choose to just say, hey, just let the young YouTubers, you know, go squirm around and work and work hard to get their stuff while I had to work hard to get my stuff. No, he said, you know what, I'm going to host, you know, a commentator's tournament. And this helped me out as well as you guys because now we both scratching each other's back and we both can get subscribers and a lot of views to our channel. I think we need more people like that. And as my channel grows and if when I get to like 100 subs, if I ever get to 100 subs, I will choose to do something like that. I will choose to host a commentator's event, you know, to get everybody a chance to be seen. Because we, I say, like I said before in my other uh, videos, we are a strong community. I think we're the best community out here because we love to, we all do the same thing we all love to do. We all love to play games and we all love to share it with each other. So if I think we all keep that in mind, you know, we can all be the greatest of all. We can show other people that games ain't just 
just for you to sit up and you know rot your brain away. You can be creative and show people what you're made of and how to and how to have games change your life and whatsoever. Uh, I think we need more of that in this in this community. If we can get more of that, we'll be a lot more stronger and a lot more allowed towards other people. But uh, enough about that for the time being. But yeah. Um, as I was saying, this is episode two. Sorry, guys, it took me so long. I've been trying to make more videos so that I don't run out. I think I wasn't trying to upload them all at once because, trust me, I was going to upload yesterday and the day before. But then I thought if I just sit up and upload these all at once, then I'm going to have to take time and remake some new material. So what I decided to do, I just said for the next two days, I just took the time off and just get more footage for the channel like today I got some more footage of Brawl that I will be uploading today too and you also can see from my uh, short montage uh, what the what what WTF shortest fights ever yeah there I'm um, I'm still deciding whether or not I'm gonna keep that going but it's a short little montage you guys tell me what's up what you think of it but um, you know but uh, I can reassure you that more uploads of Luigi Mansion is coming up right now. Spooky House, <coughs> not Luigi Man. Spooky House is coming up right now, and um, I will be uploading a promo uh, next for uh, Overflow for his channel. So please, you know, like that, view it out, you know, give me some support so I can help win, so I can try to win this and be in the top ten uh, for subscribers, so I can get a bunch of uh, views and subscribers for my channel. But um, guys, I'm gonna let you go here and let's did the let this video play out. Now uh, I'll see you guys in Spooky House episode four. All right, see you later. Thank <laughs> you.